So this is a simplification uh, of the life cycle of Ascaris lumbricoides, which is also known as the giant roundworm. And um, Ascaris is an intestinal nematode. Um, uh, as with other uh, nematodes, Ascaris looks, um, an adult Ascaris worm looks fleshy, cylindrical in shape, and the female is, is usually uh, larger than the male. And the male can be distinguished by this uh, terminal um, crooked tail. And uh, the, the life cycle is, is a bit more complicated than this, but this is just a simplification. Uh, it starts with the ingestion of uh, mature uh, fertile eggs. The uh, fertile eggs look uh, circular like this. The infertile eggs look uh, more elongated. So when the, these ova or eggs are ingested by man, they go and they hatch in the duodenum. Uh, and when they hatch in the duodenum, they release larvae. And these larvae will penetrate the wall of the duodenum and they travel uh, through the blood to the lungs. And in the lungs, they get out of these small capillaries and they go to the alveoli and they are cuffed up and swallowed again. Uh, and after they are swallowed, they go through the trachea and they move again to the, uh, from the trachea to the esophagus and they move again to the small intestines and now they settle, they mature and uh, they release uh, thousands and thousands of eggs which are usually found in feces and the life cycle repeats itself again when the egg, the mature egg is ingested again and again and again. Uh, the eggs of Ascaris lumbricoides are known to be very resistant to environmental conditions and they can live, uh, these eggs can remain viable for years uh, in, in dry uh, and warm, moist conditions. Uh, so this is basically uh, the life cycle of Ascaris lumbricoides. I hope you enjoy it.